All right, welcome to a yard sale video and also a slight announcement-y video. Um, starting off with the peacocks. This is my set of peacocks. I love these things. And I've had people come over and love these things. And uh, Cindy has sent me a brand new set to promote them with. So this set of peacocks is in the yard sale, brand new. And half of the proceeds will be going to Smile Train, please accept enclosed fleece blanket. So I got, um, I get mail here from the old owners, and apparently the woman who owned the house before me used to give to the Clef Lip Society Smile Train, and I got the mail thing with a little blanket, and I'm like, oh, fuck. All right. So I think half of the proceeds of selling the uh, Sandy Peacock will go to the Smile Train Foundation. I'll double check and make sure they're not a scam before I, you know, do that. But uh, there you go. If you want to bid on an $1,800 set of headphones that I love, DMS hates, and, uh, you know, look like this. God, that leather. Feel free to do that and know that half of the money you give will go to that foundation. Uh, other things that I'm talking about before I get to the other items. Um, this. Actually, that is that is that. Um, I'm going to have different sorts of videos on the Sound Demo channel. I may do some Mad Science Hour stuff there, where I know I've been doing it on the um, Unboxing channel, which is my original Zeo Spontera channel. But I think I'm going to film in this space. I've got to review this, like, mono price $4,000 Atmos DTSX uh, processor, but I can't integrate it into my current home theater. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to film with this camera right after I do this yard sale video, setting that up here in this little area. So I'm basically going to build a home theater from scratch, you know, just using whatever's lying around. And so if you want to see videos like that, you can find those on the sound demo channel, which I may just call a secondary channel. I don't know. Link to this glass 12 inch Lazy Susan, because it's perfect for anime figures. I have a bunch of them. I'm going to do a project with that where I build some sort of thing to hold them so they spin. I'm going to make them spin. Anyway, back to real yard sale shit. Sorry to be distracted, but I'm trying to motivate myself, and this is the best way to do it. No one no one paid for the Snowball Ice last time, so that's like a $30, $40. I don't care. B b give me a penny for it. As long as you pay, you pay for it, I'll, I'll ship this to you. Get the hell out of my house. The Wuggas is a Blondes, another brand new set. I was sent two of these. I'm keeping one of the Wuggas is a Blonde B60s, and you guys can have the other brand new one. This Amazon Basics speakers, I bought them for 50 bucks, which is probably what it would cost to ship them because they're rather large. However, if you look at the link in the description, they're like 300 fucking dollars on Amazon now. So bid accordingly. Don't actually bid the $300. It's dumb. But, it, you know, there's just another speaker that I'm just, just get out of my house. Here, not here, not here. Here are both sets of the Fluence speakers I reviewed, the AI-41s and the AI-60s. Would you like one of those? Bid on them individually. By the way, if you don't know how the yard sales work, and I always forget that some people don't, um, every month after I'm done with reviews, I'll keep some things and then sell some things. And then sometimes companies send me things to promote them, et cetera, et cetera. If you live in the continental United States or Canada uh, and are a patron or subscribe star subscriber for $5 or more, you can put a bid in on every item. And if you win, I ship it to you for, 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 well, no shipping. I won't say I ship it to you for free. I take your money and then I ship it to you and I pay for the shipping. However, if you live outside of the continental United States and Canada, um, you pay half shipping. So if you really, really, really want Wuggas of Blondes and you live in Egypt, you know, if the shipping's a hundred bucks, I pay 50 of that and you pay 50 of that and you, whatever you bid on this goes into it. I'm really just going to have to look at the list in the description because it's going to be insane. Um... The two Dakoni pads that I didn't prefer on either my XS or my Ananda. These are the Dakoni Elites. These are the Sheepskin and the Hybrid. And God, the Sheepskin are so nice. These are super comfy. And actually, they still have the markings on it from the last review here, explaining what I think they do to the XS and the Ananda. So, but this is up in the, I'll, maybe I'll sign them for you or something. But here you go. I don't need those Dakoni pads. I know Dakoni would send me more if I asked for them. If you want to set, you want both sets, both sets are one thing in the art sale, go for it. So we've got two speakers, this, I'm going to link to the glass thing, which is amazing. We've already done this, this, and this. We need to talk about the Ico Gems, which I have not reviewed yet. And I don't like to put things in the art sales that I haven't reviewed, but apparently they send me like four of them. 
and they're going to sit on my shelf. So I'm going to put the Ico gems in. We'll see how interested people are in the Ico gems. They're not even that expensive at I am. These are basically like the OH1S, I think. Yeah, so I got to get these on the review desk and actually review them. But I have two more sets of these brand new and unopened, so we'll see if anyone wants those. The fabled Klipsch McLaren True Wireless that are no good. I don't like them at all. But they're expensive, come in a waterproof case, and they look cool, and there's carbon fiber. So if you want to, want to try them, want to try the old school. There's new ones that are better than this, I'm sure. But if you want this with all its insane build and buttons and waterproofness, it's showing covered in water. There's like a splash of water. And the wireless charging case, you can bid on the Klipsch McLarens. And then finally, the uh, Feel T1XS, which was my preferred IM over the McLarens. So you can bid on both of them. If you win both, that'll be great because then you can compare and contrast. So that should be 10 items in this yard sale. So hold on. We've got Fluence 1, Fluence 2. We've got the Coney pads, that's three. The gems, the Klipsch, and the feels, that's six. The Cindy Peacocks is seven. We got eight, we got nine, and we got 10. 10 items in the yard sale, wallpaper in the description, links to a glass thing. This one goes forever because all the mass is on the outside. I spent a lot on noodle stoppers, like a lot on noodle stoppers. And this is the expensive one. I'm gonna get these, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. Because if they can't, they're probably going to be up with the mezzanine. It's going to be great. It's going to be great. It's going to be one of those projects you're going to see me build on. But now i got to end this video. Thank you all for stopping by. Please remember to share this video. Um, try to get as much bidding on the Sendy Audio Peacocks so that the, the I don't feel bad about throwing away 90% of that Smile Kids applicate. I was like, oh, I don't, oh, uh, all right, fuck it. I was going to have everyone pick the, um... The charity, but that one literally showed up in the mail, so that got chosen. Um, anything else we need before I go on? I'm gonna do, I wanted to do a state of the channel video at the beginning of January, but I had COVID at the beginning of January. I'm much better now, just more insane. Um, so I may still do that, even though it's February already, but we'll see. Anyway, 10 items in the yard sale. Thank you all for stopping by. Thank you for being patrons. If you are a patron, you get to see reviews early, participate in these yard sales, and uh, get a little access to the lossless sound demo. Still spinning. Oasis. And for $10 a month, you get to ask me questions directly in the patronage chat, which has its own swap meet. And then there's Hi-Fi Guides and the Hi-Fi Guides forum, which I want to thank, um, is it Dakoni? I think it's Dakoni. I think Dakoni is sponsoring the Hi-Fi Guides and the Hi-Fi Guides Forum. So thank you for doing that for this month. And I will see you all in two days for... Do I want to Babe Ruth call the review I'm releasing in two days? Nah. You know what? You'll see. Two days. It's two days. I'll see you.